How to Change Your Car's Oil, Part 2. You've checked out Part 1 of the series on HowCast.com and successfully drained the used oil. Now it's time to replace the filter and add new oil. You will need your car owner's manual, a car jack and jack stands, an oil pan, an oil filter wrench, a new oil filter, a funnel, a rag or a paper towel, a large resealable plastic bag, motor oil, and an approved automotive store that can dispose of your used oil and filter according to EPA standards. Changing your oil can be dangerous, so be careful. If the car is jacked up incorrectly, you can hurt yourself and damage the car. Step 1. Under the hood or under the car, locate the oil filter which is usually in the lower half of the engine block. Put the oil pan on the ground underneath the filter. With the oil filter wrench, turn the filter counterclockwise to loosen it. Slowly and carefully remove it with your hands. The filter is full of oil. Have the oil pan handy. Seal the filter in the plastic bag and set it aside. Once you remove the filter, make sure the rubber seal has come off with it and is not still attached to your car. Step 2. Open the new filter. With your finger, rub a thin layer of fresh oil around the rubber seal to lubricate it. Step 3. Install the filter securely by turning it clockwise. You don't need the oil filter wrench. If the filter is screwed in too tightly, it can be damaged. Step 4. Jack the car up slightly higher. Remove the jack stand, then lower the car back to the ground. Remove the jack. Step 5. Under the hood, insert the funnel into the oil filler you opened earlier. Pour the oil into the funnel. Most cars require 4 to 6 quarts. Don't top it off. Replace the oil cap. Step 6. Start the car, let the engine run for about 30 seconds, and then turn it off. Step 7. Under the hood, pull out the oil dipstick and wipe it with a rag or paper towel. Slide the dipstick all the way back into its slot. Pull the dipstick out again. Notice where the line of oil falls on the stick. It should be somewhere between the add and full markers. If you need to add more oil, do so. If not, replace the dipstick. Step 8. Close the hood and take your car for a spin. First stop, an automotive store to drop off the used oil and filter for proper disposal. Did you know? In 2007, an eco-friendly company produced the first widely available synthetic motor oil made entirely from animal fat.